Hello, friends and neighbors. Welcome to another production of the program. Here we are on TV once again, once a day, every day. Turn on the machines and live forever. Here we go. I'm alive. I made it all the way back around here to uh, um, Saturday. Ha, there it is. It says it right down there. Look at that. Saturday today while wow, I'm alive. Boy, howdy. Let me tell you something. I'm making it all the way back around here to now. Who's got willpower? Who's alive? Who? Anybody not alive? That's scary. Whoa! I got some food. I got some Thai pavilion today. The the, the dogs are falling down a little bit, and uh, who's gonna fix them? Nobody. Gonna live this thing, living this thing, up and down, forward and backwards, uh, spinning in circles every day, trying to just get through this, these times. What a time to be alive. Remember on, uh, other times when we were trying to be alive? Those were other times to be alive. Now it's this time. Uh huh. Yesterday, on Friday, I was here uh, at the, in the afternoon, and it's been more than 24 hours today. Yesterday, I was here on Friday around 1, 2 o'clock. I was talking to Bird a little bit, talking to Yellowfell a little bit. Uh, was I talking to Mark? Was that yesterday? I definitely listened to Mark's messages. Mark's uh, struggling, like we all are, claiming to get the vaccine shot, and then is he gonna get it or not? Who knows? Nobody knows. I mean, I thought, you think you know? You think you know? You have no idea. This uh, is the real world from the 90s. You think you have, you think you know? You have no idea. Because what happens when you put 10 strangers into a home and things get real. Welcome to the real world. Bum 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 ba dum ba dum. Welcome Pokemon and Slam. And welcome to the real world 1993. Uh, yesterday Talking to Yellow Fellow, talking to Freddy, maybe was talking to Freddy, talking to who, to who. And uh, today, after the program yesterday, I went up there to my job on the bike. I biked to my my work, I believe. Uh, then. I did that, and I completed that as a regular kind of day. And then I came down here on, um, uh, what day, what, what day is it? I uh, came back down here to meet up with the movie club. Freddy's in that, Freddy the producer and others to watch a movie, but they, uh, Wanted to go to a bar, which was kind of scary. I don't know about the bars. And they're like, we're at a bar. Can you meet me at this bar? And I said, okay. I'm a, I am don't know. I don't know what's running around. People are like, come do, like, I'm not going to the bars until somebody's like, hey, go to this bar. Well, I guess I'm going to go to this bar now. Is this right or wrong? I don't know. And if you say so, then I'm just going to do it. Like, like, if you say so, come over to this bar. All right. All right, George, if you say so, I'll go. And then I did go to the bar, and it was kind of crowded and kind of scary. I didn't take off my mask while I was inside. I didn't drink anything. Didn't take off the mask, just like, looking around, being like, whoa, this is crazy. Most people are just living 
uh, what some people say, their best life. Just living your best life, just doing stuff, not not having a care in the world. But I have a few cares in the world. I'm afraid, or, or I don't know, I'm afraid. It's a tough word. Am I afraid? I'm concerned, at least. I'm at least concerned. Went to the bar, concerned. Um, where's the eggplant? I want the eggplant. There's not that much in here. Is there any? Oh, I don't know if they, I thought when I said eggplant, maybe they thought I said no eggplant. I would have said extra eggplant. Um, went to the bar. People have their mask off, people sitting in there doing things. There's a crowded show that I walk by outside with my mask on. So I left early because it was wasn't having that good of a time. I watched the movie and I uh, went home to my residence to lay my head. And I uh, came back over here to no, well, then I no the next day I, I made it back home. Fred gave me a ride and then. I came back on to work today again and did that all the day, all day. And then I came back down here. And then I went to Thai Pavilion. And on my way there though today, somebody I didn't know, you know. Basically. A crazy street guy. One of, one of these, like, uh, I don't know, slap and pound, what do you call it? Boom, like this, and you want, you want to do a little shoulder bump. And I don't want to say no, thank you, but I did it. I shook it. I, like, did the quick handshake thing with a stranger who was a little off his rocker, too. I was like, oh, man, this guy's actively spreading diseases with the virus or something. But I, I don't know, I went in for it. I was wearing my mask. I was outside, so... Who knows? And then I immediately went into the, I was like right outside the restaurant I was going to put the food up. And inside the restaurant I put on the hand sanitizer that they had there. And I was like, oh man, I hope that guy at the bar, outside the, outside the restaurant didn't. After we have the virus, and who's he, who's he picking hands with? Just everybody on the street. So that was a little weird. I think I'm gonna ride the bus back today anyway. So whatever. The restaurant was pretty crowded. People in there eating. People are dying in other places though. People living, people dying. Some song I think, right? People living, people dying. Um, and then I made it back here. Yesterday I got a ton of water at night time after the program too. I was on, I didn't include that in my story though, but I did get two liters plus two 20 ounce bottles plus this uh, half a gallon or something. But I'll fit in my bag, nothing spilled out and I made it. So what a life. Now I'm back here again for the 3,969th time. Oh yeah, we're gonna be getting into 4,000 in about a month. What are we gonna do? Probably, I don't know, <laughs> very little, something. Probably just be here doing this. Maybe. Get bird here. Tell bird to bring the baby. Talk to the baby. Talk to the baby. Say, baby, you are the future. I believe. I believe that children are the future. Um, I guess I think the children are 
are literally the future. So maybe we can get the baby on episode 4000 and tell him. That's my plan. Ding, ding, ding. 4,000 days. It takes over 10 years to, to live 4,000 days. Almost 11 years. We're uh, getting pretty close to 11 years here. Then what? Oh. Ten years, Freddy planned a big thing. Uh, maybe that was Premier of the County. Maybe it was Bull. We had a pretty big... Oh, jeez! I spilled with water everywhere. Well, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Put the water into a bag? It'll just dry. It's too hot in here. Uh, nothing. Nothing too much is getting wet. Just like nothing more. I'm going to put this water <laughs> into this plastic bag. Squeeze it out in napkins and oh, water's going into this plastic bag. Oh, uh, you know, after I went and collected it too, I had to go all the way out there. I didn't seal this bottle very well, and then I knocked it over, and I didn't even pay attention to it because I thought that it would be uh, more sealed than it was. Well, I watched it get knocked over, but it's very dry out. It was raining a little bit. Just helping wet things. I'm wetting things now. What are you doing? Wetting? I'm wetting. Wet, wet the sponge or the, like the, the stickers or something or like a sponge, uh, uh, a temporary tattoo. Someone's getting on the meat. Oh, I gotta go over there and let them in. <clears throat> See who it is. Do -do -do Whoa, almost falling. Almost falling, falling over. Do -do 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 Let me move in song. It's yellow fellow. Hello. Hi. Hi, yellow fellow. How are you? Uh, did I interrupt your couch time? In a way. But also, Sorry. it was it was winding down anyway. All right. Did you interrupt it or did you? Uh, flow into the end of it. Oh, okay. Also, what can be interrupted? I didn't really have much of a plan, you know? That's true. If, I, if I had more of a plan, like, you're interrupting my plans. Well, the stream of consciousness. Yeah. I didn't you're have a plan. Right. How are you're you? What agent, are you doing? You're an agent of chaos. Uh... I was at Taco Bell. You're at Taco Bell currently? No, I was. Oh. No, I'm on the... I got the video thing going right now. Oh. I'm on the, I'm on the road. Oh, yeah. Hey, there it is. Is the um the Taco Bell in that farm town? You have to drive a little bit for this one. The one I was at. You have to drive like half an hour. And it's like... It, now it's more like in a city atmosphere. Like, it's closer to like... Like suburbs and thing things. What's Taco Bell's big promotion right now? Huh? What are they trying to sell? A Taco Bell. What like, are they trying to sell? Like what's in the window? You know? Oh, there's a car! Ah! Wait, what? What's in the window? Oh, like, oh, um, you know, it was a little different because it was a KFC uh, oh. Taco Bell, and they pushed KFC more at Taco Bell. I, I mean, at the combos, then, um, 
than they do push Taco Bell. Yeah, did you get any KFC stuff? I was trying to put the KFC hot sauce on Taco Bell stuff. Well, it it didn't really work. Um, like it didn't it didn't it didn't gel too well. Like this the condiments though, just like on the by yourself. Huh? You just like got the condiments and then did that yourself, right? Yeah. Yeah. But I got my brother. I'm about, my brother is at the house where I'm dog sitting. Right now. Yeah. She said I could have him over. Okay. Um, if I want to, and I'm bringing him a bunch of Taco Bell, and uh, I, he said bring as much mild, you know, like the mild Taco Bell sauce. Yeah, it's like he weak said, ketchup. Yeah, he said bring as much as you can, so I bought, I got like giant handfuls, handfuls of it. And was he gonna drink it? He uses a scary amount of it. Mild sauce, huh? Yeah, I feel like I'm so tired right now. I feel like drunk on tiredness. Yeah, that's dangerous. I heard that it's dangerous to drive when you're that tired. Yeah, no, I didn't. Yeah, that's why. I, it just like just hit me, and I'm like I'm pulling into the, the uh, development now. So. Did you? I mean, uh, did you ever ask me like, hey, can you put some mashed potatoes in my burrito? <laughs> that's a good question to ask. I should ask that. But I think they wouldn't take me seriously. They think it was like a joke. Yeah. I don't know if it would be a joke. I, I would probably think of some. I kind of want to try because I get refried bean on everything. I talked about. Mhm. Mm it might be nice to get refried. I wonder what refried bean and like mashed potatoes and a burrito would taste like. Probably pretty good. With cheese, that might be good. I think it'd yeah. be good. That actually might be good. Um. Oh. I like KFC. But I like Popeyes more. You got Popeyes yeah, out there? I, we have Popeyes. That's yeah. It's more like a city thing, the Popeyes. Yeah. Um. But here's that red door again. With the cross. Do you remember that part? Do you remember I that do. part in uh, Twin Peaks season three? Where like they're asking him like where's your home where do you live red and he door goes, red door red door, red door. <laughs> yeah um, he does have a red door I told my friend uh, Dia about this show he might I told him to start watching I because I was ha I went to I've been doing too much like between well I wasn't doing a lot leading up to this little stint of doing too much. But like just I had that show I went to, I made the shirts for it. Oh yeah, how'd that go? All, it was fun, it went well. It was a, a great show and I just kinda like Did they buy the shirts? I gave them to my friend. I was like, here, just take them, get them away from me. And then he went and sold them. So that was good. They kept the money, which people, is fine. People bought them? Using the band. What's that? People bought the shirts though? Yeah. It was only like six of them. But yeah, they went, and, uh, what was I going to say, um, the, it was great, I saw, like, so many people that I haven't seen, like, so many people that I haven't seen since, like, before COVID, it felt like a reunion, um, mm -hmm. it was kind of nice, and then, so I did that, and it was actually a great time. Yeah, yeah, and, I, and I it, actually did a similar thing yesterday with, like, the, the local music scene, well, oh yeah. Like, yeah, there was a crowded bar, and then I went over there, and then I saw a bunch of people I hadn't seen in a year, like too many of them. To, and like, I'm like, who do I even say hi to? It's like I know some, I know, you know, it's like I don't know how your music scene is, but it's like I know so many people, but like, yeah, do I? I don't really ever talk to them, and we don't talk to each other, but we all know yeah. each other. Yeah. But, no, that's like exactly what I was going through yesterday. Yeah. Uh, there's also a good amount of people I didn't want to see, but it's fine. Uh, more like two or three, but there's a, there's a majority of people I was happy to see, so it was good. Um, but and then I woke, and then I um, I helped at like a five like an obstacle course like 5k thing this morning. Uh huh. Uh, it's just some random gig thing I found online, which was like. One of the things I had to do was like one of the last things 
people did on this race was like went down like a big water slide thing. It was like 30 what? feet tall, like a 30 foot tall like blow up like slide thing. And I had to like help people deflate that and roll it up, which is like a good, weird experience. Uh, yeah, but I was, I was just like, gig work. I was just exhausted. Huh? Gig work, huh? Gig work. Yep. Yep. Which I'm gonna say goodbye to the gig work stuff because I'm going back to work like two days. Wow. Uh, but uh. Anyway, I got my brother some uh, Taco Bell. I'm gonna bring it inside to him. Uh, I'll maybe I'll come join back in like uh, 15 minutes. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. Well, bye, y'all. Uh... Well, it's still daytime. Oh, I gotta eat my pill. I got uh. Good amount of pills. Eight, eight pills. Two or doubles. Mark left another message and call him back today. I'll call him back now. Oh, and bird too. Was that today? Oh, yes, that was yesterday. Hi, Kenny. This is Mark and Rebecca. I just thought I'd let you know that uh, well, we decided to get our shot over at Safeway, and that'll be comfortable this week, and we'll get that done and stuff. And that shouldn't be too hard. I don't think there's going to be any lines at Safeway. There's Safeway Road right here on, on Carpenter Road, so Carpenter Pacific. So we'll, we'll get our shots and stuff. I think my sister's going to deal with that, so we can deal with that and stuff, you know. Yeah, it'll be nice to get that over with. And, of course, there's probably going to be another shot so many weeks after that or something. I don't know. I don't That's know right. Details about I can ask him and stuff. I'll talk to you later, Kenny. See you later, uh, Freddie. And we'll, ho hopefully we can all get together and have coffee or something or something. I'll get together after a few weeks after you get the vaccine, nice. Mark. Oh, boy. You guys know where we live, so. <laughs> I do. That's true. I've been to your so house. Give us a call. I will right bye now. Bye now. I'm calling you right now. Hello. Hi, Rebecca. Hey, Kenny. Hi, how are ya? Oh, Freddie, hi. Okay. When's Freddie's birthday again, Kenny? February 7th. My mom's February 13th. Oh, um, very close. When's your birthday, Kenny? April 1st. No lie. Yeah, it's on Wonderful, the... wonderful. Then January 11th is my birthday. With yeah, your mother, you have the same mother. birthday as my mom. Yeah. Yeah. I remember I remember January when you had your birthday. It's my birthday. You Two, had McDonald's yeah. on your birthday this year. Uh I will be twenty one. <laughs> yeah. Me too. Yes, we hope to do to let here, I'll, I will let you talk with Mark now, love. Um Okay. Keep uh the yeah. faith. Uh, little, uh, Mark and Mark. Keep the program uh, you know, in business, um, our daily hour, and hope they find a cure for the virus someday. And oh, yeah. Yeah, Mark said you're going to get the vaccine safe. next week. Well, huh? Mark needs to talk to you, Kenny. Okay. We love you guys. Love, love you. you, gals. Thank you. We love you. This is the daily hour. Hey. Hey, Mark. Yeah, you know what Brian did? He fucked up my guitar. Really? How did he do that? Well, the, he popped the piece out of our, uh, where you put your strings. Is that the guy you got in a fight with? No, I didn't fight him. I just told him to leave. I was going to get him a cab because he was so drunk, I didn't want him to get, in, you know, get run over or nothing. He was drunk at your house? He was drunk at my house. I didn't want him to get run over. I was going to get him a cab, and he took off anyway. 
He's driving drunk? No, walking. Oh. I didn't want okay. him to get hit by a car. I don't want anybody to get hit by a car. No, he'll probably be okay, though. He's walking. Well, I mean, I like him when he's when he's straight and everything, and but when he gets drunk, he looks lippy and all that. Yeah, too drunk. Shouldn't be that drunk. Uh, mostly, yeah, you around you. I, mean, I know you don't I, like drunk. I wish I had a, got him a cab or something so he could go home, you know. Well, go home he, and rest it off or something. Did you know? he make it home? Did you talk to him? Yeah, he's all right. Well, that's good. I mean, I, I wish I would have got him a cab. That way he would have uh, came home safe and stuff. But he made it home safe anyway, though, right? Yeah, he did. He's okay. a good walker. Yeah. Oh, oh! I just dropped some of my vitamins. Do you take vitamins, Mark? I, I actually, I don't, but I do drink the vitamin water. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Blueberry the... vitamin water, you ever had it? Yeah, vitamin water is just Kool-Aid, Mark. Huh? That stuff is a scam. I like it. I mean, it tastes good, but it's Kool-Aid. Yeah, it probably is. There's yeah. no, there's no health benefits in it. Now I gotta find something uh, pointy and sharp to push this piece out of my, so I can put my new Like a knife? Huh? Like a knife, maybe? No, no, it has to be a real pointy thing or something. Like a, push like, it out. like a pencil? No. Pointier, yeah. pointier than a sharp, than a pencil? My guitar's fucked up now. What's more pointy than a pencil? No, it has to be smaller than a pencil. It has to be something pointy. Uh, like a like a, a needle. A needle or something. Yeah, wow. What what part is it that's messed up? It's the third string from the bottom. Mm. I got this little plastic deal that's supposed to come in there first before you put the string in. Yeah. It's, the Ibanez, it's an Ibanez guitar. You was messing around? You let him mess around with the inside of the guitar? Hey, I... I go to the bathroom. I don't expect him to go in the bathroom with me. But you went you went to the bathroom, you came back out, and he had messed up your guitar? And he was fucking with my guitar, oh. yeah. And he broke it. I'm not going to have, hey, I'm not going to have him in my house no more. Really? He's a bass player, though. <laughs> Shit, no, no, I don't know what to do. Well, you shouldn't have people I in your house anyway, because you got to get... I don't have a guitar to play now. Damn uh, it. I thought you had several guitars. I got rid of most of them, and I got the big speakers. I got sold the big speakers because this apartment isn't made for stuff like that. You know, it, it's actually made for stuff with headphones, you know. Who'd you sell them to? Well, like some Christian guy named John. Christian John, huh? Well, he's a Christian. He's a, he uh, records people, Christian music and stuff. That's his main thing? He does it for a hobby. What, Christianity? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh-oh. I got my money's worth and everything, but God dang it, that damn brand fucked up my guitar. Mm-hmm. He's the bass I player. Know, I shouldn't be, I shouldn't be swearing like that, you know. Yeah, I guess so. Does he play, he plays the bass? He plays the bass, yeah. Oh. Well, that's too I bad. Know, I'm gonna get, I don't know how I'm going to get this thing out of here. With a needle. Needle, yeah. Hmm. You have a needle? Nope. No, Rebecca's not a, a, a seamster? I'm pretty, much, I'm pretty much screwed if I want to play a guitar now. Well, don't you? Huh? Doesn't Rebecca have a needle? I don't know. Rebecca, do you have a needle? No, no. You gotta go to the dollar store. We gotta get the vaccine uh, first. I, I do have an idea, though. Yeah, what? Uh, smoke 20 pounds of heroin. Hey, good idea. Oh, shit. Uh, you know those needles you use for, for stitching stuff and stuff? I do. If I could find one of those things, or, or maybe a safety pin or something. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I'm not talking about drug needles. No, I'm talking about a safety pin or something. Yeah. Damn it. It's, I should have never let him in my house, man. You don't have a paper clip? Huh? 
How drunk was he? How do you know he was drunk? Did he say so? Oh, I loaded him some money. I thought he was just going to buy some chips or something at the store. Chips and pop or something at the store. And he goes and he fucking buys beer. Then he manipulates us and says he's only going to drink one, and I saw him drink fucking three of those fuckers. Yeah, you gave, you, you bought it, huh? Huh? And you bought it for him, too. No, I, he's old enough to drink. Yeah, but, no, but he, you gave him the money? I gave him the money because he said he was going to buy chips and stuff and pop and stuff. And then he comes back with the beer, and then I guess I said, what the fuck, you're supposed to buy chips. And he goes, no, I bought beer. And I said, well, just drink one. And then, and then I, I was playing my guitar, not really paying attention and stuff, and he ended up drinking three of them, getting fuckers loopy and bitchy and stuff. <laughs> yeah, three beers. Some people drink three beers. I don't like that call. I don't like that call, and I don't like drugs. I think you can go to hell if you want to do drugs in our house. Fuckers. <laughs> yeah, was he doing drugs? No, he's just doing the alcohol. But that was enough to give us a bunch of... We fucking lost our peace of mind in this. Huh? It takes a couple times all when he left. Yeah, you shouldn't be... You, you're not supposed to be socializing unless you get the vaccine anyway. What is that, Rebecca? What the fuck is that on your plate? <laughs> what is going on? Mark, are you agitated? Why are you cursing so much? Huh? What's on Rebecca's plate? What is it? Oh, it was those meat patty things. Meat patty? I think there might be some in here. That fucking chump, I'm going to kick his ass. <laughs> Are you going to, Brian? Yeah, I'm going to kick his ass. And if he calls the cops, I'm going to fucking kick the cops' ass. Uh-oh, hey, Mark, you, 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 you maybe got to get back on that Thorazine. No, I got to kick some ass is what I got to do to let all that fucking tension out. Yeah, I think you got to forgive. I'm in the bathroom. I'm in the bathroom right now. There might be a... Like a hairpin or something I can use. Yeah. Ah, shit. There's always something getting in the way, isn't there, Kenny? <laughs> well, there is, but there's, I mean, if you accept that, that's okay. And then you, I think you got to forgive. That's the best way. Uh, holding grudges is no uh, no good for uh, anybody. I just tried to get him a cab so he could come home safely, and, I, and he ran off. He <laughs> ran? So, Where does he live? Well, he walked. He, he, wa he walked. He walked over here. He didn't take a car or nothing. So he's but been. He just. He lives fuck. pretty close to you. Then he doesn't want to get a cab. You know what, Kenny? My day's fucking screwed now. That was today. He. I you? hate to say that, you know, but it's true. That was today. He broke it. No, I said my day is screwed. Oh yeah, when did he break it? Yesterday. Here's something. No, that won't work. And now shit. God damn it. Yep. Look, nothing here I can use. All I need is a safety pin with the fuck? Or what do you call them? Paper clip will work. Aren't they, they're like tapering off your medications, Mark? Huh? Are they tape, they're tapering, tapering your medication, is that right? Go blow your nose, Kenny, I feel fine. All right. You said in your, your you said in your message. I, I, I kick your ass, Kenny, and then I'll order a pizza. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just joking. All right. Hey, um, you said in your message you you made an appointment to get the vaccine. Is that right? Yeah, uh, the vaccine I'm getting this this Thursday. And you made an appointment for it? Yes, I did. Good, Mark. I'm 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 being reliable, you know. Yeah, well, once you get the here's, vaccine... Here's some, oh, here's some that'll fucking work right here. Oh, yeah, man, this is going to fucking work. It's going to work. God dang it. And then you get the second uh, vaccine. No help from, from Brian, huh? And then we can meet up, maybe. This will work. This will get it out. <sighs> Shit. All this trouble, you know, just because I, I loaned him some fucking money and stuff. All that fucking trouble. Isn't that stupid? I was yeah. a dipshit, you know that? I yeah, don't sucker. loan people money. Gee, uh, Kenny, I was a fucking sucker. Where, where did you meet this guy? Well, uh, I've, I've known him for months. You know him for a long time? Huh? You know, you know him for a long time? Yeah, he's been doing... 
he hasn't been doing this stuff, but I mean, when he, uh, shit, how can I put this in here? He was, he was drinking beer and shit, you know? Yeah. And I, I, and see, and then Rebecca said, he's secretly going in the other room and drinking more. And so what the fuck? I loan him money to be nice so he can buy some chips and pop and stuff. Yeah, and then just goes and... And then he does this to me, you know. What? What a jerk. That's stupid. You know, I try to be nice to him, and then he screws me over. That's not nice. Not nice. No, it's not. Um... Well, here's that deal. I think you should forgive him anyway. Oh, I do, I do. I was just hoping that he would go home and sleep it off or something. Yeah. You, yeah. you know, you know what I mean? Like, just sleep it off? Sleep off the beer? Sleep off the beer. It's only three beers. Well, he's a nice guy and everything when when he's straight and stuff, you know. I mean, I don't, I don't really dislike him or nothing. I just dislike it when he fucks up like that. You know? People have a drinking problem. Well, he doesn't always do it. That's oh. why I, I, I let him in the house all the time. He doesn't always yeah. do that. He just did this one time. Well, I know, I know. Everybody messes up once in a while, you know. <laughs> That's the biggie. Um, I, I mean, wanna... nobody's perfect, right? Nobody's no, perfect. Nobody's perfect. He's not. Nobody's perfect, you know. Nobody's okay, perfect. Uh, I want to record messages of the future. Oh, I like that when you do that. That's cool. Well, here we go. Hey, future. Test the past. Hey, future. Going to rock and roll. Hey, future, gonna rock and roll. <laughs> uh, Mark's in a weird mood, I guess, because somebody broke his guitar, and it's, uh... Hey, you, know, you won't believe it. I've only had two cigarettes today. Drunk people. Okay, bye, future. No, I'm, no seriously. Bye, I'm a chain smoker, and I've only had two cigarettes today. Isn't that cool? Hey, way to go, Mark. That's good. I'm getting up in the morning. Night. See, I'm playing more guitar and stuff, and then, and then, and then I have to use two hands, and so I can't smoke. You used to smoke, you used to chain smoke? I, I, I was always a chain smoker, and it was bad news, you know. Yeah, you light it's one cigarette. It, it's, not, it's not really good to be a chain smoker. No, you real bad. bad health problems. You, you yeah, light one you cigarette? You bad health problems. Light one cigarette with the last one, huh? Yeah, I just had a cup. Well, I had one and a half a butt or something. Yeah, it's hard to breathe. Is it hard to breathe? Yeah, it's not good, and it messes up your throat, too. Yeah. Can't can't do any singing and stuff. I like to sing, but shit, when I smoke a cigarette, I can't sing. How's the, yeah, yellow fellow, how's the Taco Bell? Yeah. I already ate it. Yeah, my video's not too exciting right now. You might not want to focus on it. All right. Yellow fellow. Hey, Kenny, everything's cool. I fixed my guitar, so. You did just now? Did just now? Yeah, just now. Yeah. Oh, how'd you do that? How'd you do that? I poked, you, I poked that pin thing or whatever it was, the hairpin in there. Oh, yeah, well, then, then Brian, then you can forgive Brian, then. It worked. I think God actually put his foot down and fixed it for me. <laughs> Jesus, God. Stop. Yeah. Hey, okay. Hey, you look, okay. Are you doing something on the video? You got a toy? Actually, yeah, I was going to say, it's, it's better now. Well, it's, you know, it's like, it's expensive, man. It's a $250 guitar. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah. That's a lot of money for a guitar, huh? Uh, yeah. yeah. What is that? Yeah. I think it's my drugs. It's it looks playing. cool now. It's is that a Taco right. Bell empanada? Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, we're talking to Yellow Fellow now. He's on the on the line, Mark. Hey, I, I got a question for you. Who, for me? Kenny, I got a question oh, for you. Yeah, what? Do you know Green Fellow? Green File? Green file? Green Fellow. Green Fellow, no, who's that? Do you know Purple Fellow? I only know Yellow Fellow. <laughs> what about Purple and Green Fellow? No. Nope. I'm just joking. I'm just joking, Kenny. <laughs> <laughs> you know, hey, maybe we probably just haven't found him yet. Yeah, somewhere. somewhere. Yeah. Mark's a joker once in a while, don't worry about it. Oh, <laughs> uh, I was worried. Um, <laughs> we'll go back and watch we'll it. Those, those namesake episodes. Hey, when I get my when I get my uh, shots done and everything, you want to come over and have coffee? That'd be kind of cool. 
Yeah, well, you have, yeah, to, get have to get the first shot, first and then you... You don't drink coffee, do you? I do drink coffee. Oh. Yeah, um, we have lots of coffee. I want to bring drugs to your house, though, Mark. Huh? <laughs> Not really. You just told me how much you don't like drugs. But, um... I want to... You have to, see, you have to get the vaccine. And then you wait like a month, and then you get the second vaccine. Well, here's what I'm going to do, Kenny. When I, after I get my shot, I'm going to still wear the mask in the store. That's a good idea. Yeah, just be protected, you know. You got to get the first. Well, you get the first shot, and then you have to wait a month or so. No, I mean after the even after the second shot, I'm still going to wear my mask. I do also. And then you, yeah, wait, you have to, protection. You wait it's a month, and then you get the second shot, and then you have to wait another couple of weeks. So you yeah, still got I always like, wear my mask. You still got about two months before you can do anything, I think, Mark, because you got to get that. You know what I always thought? I always thought someone who wears a mask and go to the store looks like they're going to kind of fucking rob the store or something. Yeah, that's yeah. how it used to be. Now it's like... I'm, I'm a burglar now. I got a mask on. But now it's the other way around. It used to be if you yeah, had a mask, you're a scary person. I advantage of that. I'm, 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 a, I'm a robber. I got a mask on now. Yeah. <laughs> what, are you, what are those toys? Are those your childhood toys? I think yeah. they're Jarvis's. Oh, um, dog toys. You're, oh, you're at, you're at Jarvis's house, not at your mom's house. Yeah, he's outside. Hey, uh, Jarvis. hey Kenny. Jarvis. What? Can I kick your ass and order a pizza? No. Oh. Why not? Come on, why not? Uh, <laughs> what'd you eat for dinner? Uh, we had those uh, meat patties again. What's meat patties? meat patties? You know, the ones with the barbecue or whatever. So, like, Hungry Man? Yeah, Hungry Man. You ever had Hungry Man yeah, frozen hungry dinners? Yeah, right. no. Wait, uh, uh, wait. Uh, Mark, you like the, like, Red Baron pizza, right? Is that Freddy? Yellow fellow. Yellow fellow. Hey, Yellow hey. fellow, can I kick your ass and order a donut? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sure can. I fixed, my, I fixed my guitar. I'm in a jokey mood now. No, everything's better. You were cursing up a storm. Yeah, Wait, you were um, you were upset with your bass player recently, I heard? The bass player broke his guitar, but he fixed it. Oh, he doesn't know how to play bass. He thinks he does, but he fucking sounds like shit. <laughs> oh. See, Jarvis is upset because he wants to go inside, but he's that not a good boy. That the bass sounds like fucking bags. shit. He doesn't know how to do the fucking notes. Wow. He's, wow. A, he's a fucking mangaloid. A mangaloid? No, I said Brian's a fucking mangaloid. What's a mangaloid? Mongo I think mangaloid is a... I don't know. A... I have to look it up in the dictionary to find out what it means. I think that's like mediumly... Is that racist? How about a jekyll? Maybe he's a demon Mongoloid, it might be. Yeah, maybe, Mark, maybe, yeah, maybe Brian's a fucking demon or something. Yeah, maybe he's a demon, but I think Mongo... Maybe, maybe he's come from Alaska or something. Well, I think actually, I think Mongoloid might be a term for, uh... Like, Mangaloid. I think that's like a uh, outdated term for the differently abled. You don't think that's I funny? Think also, I think it has a different uh, <laughs> connotation as well, though. We'll look it up. I know, I'm being harsh on him. I think that that, think that, that is that's an antiquated that's term for the differently abled. Yeah, I'm probably being too harsh on him. Yeah. 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 What are you going to do today? Well, I already did most of it. I went to work. I did all this stuff. You got to watch the program. You've been watching the program? Hey, go to, hey, Kenny, do you ever go to Walmart? I do. I uh, do. Do you ever go in that uh, electric section and stuff? Or whatever it's called? Uh, well, they got cell phones and stuff. I'm thinking about getting me a cell phone. Why? Why? And, huh? Why? Why? Because it's, because every time I try to get, use someone's phone, they bitch at me. Why, why, you are you your using, phone. why are you using people's phones? To call a cab, damn it. I don't have a car. <laughs> yeah, you're calling you cabs all the time? I have to call cabs to get over to the damn, uh, my doctor's appointment and shit, and then they don't want me using their fucking phone. They want me to get a cell phone. I, I thought you used dial or lift. Dial a faggot? I don't use dial a faggot. What, Mark? You're getting crazy today. Why are you saying, like, Mark, that's a very bad word to be saying. You shouldn't say that. Hey, look, hey, look, hey, look motherfucker. I could, be, I could be a natural guy. I'm doing natural right now.
No, but you, yeah, so work with that's me. a, that's work a. Work with me, motherfucker, work with me. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Don't say that word, Mark. I'll give you 50 cents. I'll give you 50 cents. You're going to give me 50 cents, and then I'm going to let you use, like, slurs? <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll give you a dollar fifty if you, if you, if you work with me. Mark. What? It's, we're living in a new time where homosexuality is accepted by society. Kenny, you know I'm just bullshitting anyway. So no, there's no it. excuse. There's no excuse for that. I'm using back in the language. Hey, I just got frustrated with this Brian guy, so what do you think? You know, I need there's, to get some don't time use, off, Don't use those kind of words. That's a good... Uh, okay, a, I'm sorry. I said I'm sorry. Shit. No, no it's, I, 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 I forgive you, but... Uh, it's a beautiful love there between two men. To say I'm not sorry. Two, I'm sorry the love between two you? men is a beautiful thing, Mark. Oh, for Pete's sake, you're hard to get along with. You know that? Oh uh, yeah. Um, the the what? Hey, remember when Mount St. Helens blew? I don't think I was alive for that. Oh, when my when my, I was alive, and I'm 57 now, so. When I was alive, Mount St. Helens blew and it had all ashes all over my mom's car. <laughs> yeah, what had that? What happened? No, I don't know. We washed it off and stuff, but she got a new car eventually. Do you think those fires there's outside? Fire? No, the ashes can ruin your car. Yeah. Uh, there was yeah, like smog horrible. all the way over here on the east coast from the fires. And on you the know west about coast. this virus, virus, uh, Kenny? Yeah, I do. It's horrible that people are having a lot of trauma because of the people dying on them and stuff. Yeah, it is bad. People horrible. are dying all the time. That's horrible, yeah. Kenny. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't yeah. want to have my family members die because of a virus. <laughs> nope. That's horrible. It's, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yellow had the virus. Yeah. Mm. I had it in uh, December. Well, hey, Kenny, I got to go. So right. he's calling in. White, white man's virus, I call it. Hey, Kenny, I got to go. Someone's calling in. Okay, Mark. Beware of the white okay. devil, okay, Mark? Look out for the white devil. Blanco Diablo. See you later, yellow fellow. Blanco right. Diablo. Look okay, bye, Mark. Blanco Diablo, Mark. Bye-bye bye -bye. now. Uh, Mark is... <laughs> I, uh, Mark, Mark's an old-fashioned kind of guy. Yeah. He, he was, a, like, animated tonight. He was. Yeah, I think he's, um... I think his, his medication is... They're changing it. Because <laughs> I never heard him quite like that. He's on a lot of sedatives. Is he? Well, he was. I think that they're tapering him off the sedatives. Oh, that might make sense. Maybe they should put him back on the sedatives. Right. Because maybe he wouldn't be so bigoted. <laughs> I don't what, know. What, what, what did he say, fairy? Um, no, he said, he said the, the worser one. Oh, that starts with the same letter? Yes. Oh, that's not good. Not good. Not good, Mark. The lo oh, uh, I'm very uh, accepting. Here and of course we are um, more more than accepting. Yeah. I. Yeah. But um the the Mar Mark. Talk about iced tea. Mark has, I don't know if uh. It's like you he, he don't he, he, Sometimes it's like what do I do when Mark said like bad things like that that in the past and what do I do like cancel culture him? Well well. Mr. Ginsu, he Mr. Ginsu used to say a lot of crazy yeah, stuff. Yeah, right? Mr. Ginsu was very um he said a lot of bad things but he never was uh said any any bigoted things. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, oh that's that yeah. So I never even like heard much of Mr. Ginsu. I would hear him talked about all the time, but I would never like like yeah, I, I I watch a lot more of the program now than I ever used to, so I, I would like miss him a lot. And you like when I would call in in the past, we didn't really do like the like party calls. Yeah. Well, Mr. Ginsu, um, he was he cursed a lot, but he was very uh, you know modern. He had the modern sensibilities about being a bigot. Yeah, now, he was a real character. I was I was listening to so I I like come across his episodes like often enough He was now. wild, but Mark, sorry to say, Mark, but you're a bit of a bigot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I was, um, I was listening to an episode from, I think, 2018, where Mr. Gensu left you a series of long messages where he was, uh, laying out this whole, like, fantasy of, like, you and Freddy hanging out and 
somebody walks up to Freddy and kicks him in the balls, and uh, and then, then the Freddy, doctor. But, yeah, the doctor. <laughs> yeah. I think he. I think we end up being dead at the end of the story, and then he, he, and then we get resurrected by getting stuffed full of quality marijuana. <laughs> yeah, it's a good, it's a good story. Yeah, I think it, you know, like I die. I think we both get killed somehow. And Mr. Ginsu, Ginsu resurrects our bodies by cutting us open and filling our cavities up with marijuana. That's good. And it brings That's us good. back to the dead. Of, it was a lot of repetition of you guys getting hit in the balls, though. Yeah. That was good. Hey, I'm going to call you back on the uh, Google Meet. Oh, that was Bird from yesterday. Bird. Um, I left you another summary. Oh, yeah. i got to get yeah. it on there. Are you checking up? I'm not sure where am I, uh, let's see. Oh, let's call my brother. Let's call my brother oh, while Andrew. I get the seminar. Uh, it's, uh, what's it called? I was listening to an episode today with you and Carl talking. To you guys were talking about Flint water well, about what? Episode, did I? Uh, I think you did. Did Hello? you? I don't know. Andrew? Uh, Hi. What? Hi, Andrew. It's program on TV. How are you? Good. How are you doing? Good. What are you, what are you doing? Hey, what are you doing? Watching YouTube. Yeah, what is it? Uh, sir, watching this guy. He's, uh, he does. Sketches about living in the Midwest, and it's really funny for some reason. Are you? In, so you back. Are you in the Midwest, Yelpo? I think I'm on the East Coast. Huh. They hit Philadelphia. That's the East Coast. Yeah, it's, it's as like East right Coast as it gets, pretty much. Wow. Oh. Yeah, it's right next to New York. It is. Yeah, I we went over this. I I could drive like two hours from Philly and be in New York City. Oh, okay. What? Oh. Uh, is it, a, is it uh, on the coast? Um, well, I mean, I can drive like two and a half hours and be at like the shore. Okay. Pennsylvania is landlocked? Uh, yeah, I believe so. Yeah, yeah. I think, uh, yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah. But Jersey, okay. Jersey is right next to us. Yeah. I see. What state is to the west? Um,. I think it's Ohio. Ohio. I'm not really good with like geography, even if it's like very basic geography. <laughs> uh. yeah. yeah. You seem a little confused too, Kenny. So you can't tease me. Yeah, for I that. don't know anything about. I know like all the. Oh, uh, hey, it's uh, Jarvis. It's Jarvis. Yeah, you might. This is the last time you're gonna see Jarvis on the show. Actually. Oh, Jarvis. Maybe ever. I want to get a dog. I might. I might get if I get the state job and then go live at Andrews with Andrew, and I'm then get yeah. a dog. You'll be there like you a go. family guy. You'll be like a you'll, yeah, like a do uh, that. a regular person. Well, if I get this, if I get yeah, I'm gonna be a regular person. If I get the state job. Yeah. Maybe I don't know if I accidentally didn't upload the episode from the last night. I know you did. You named it Old Quesadilla. Oh, okay. Oh, there it is. Yeah, Old Quesadilla. <laughs> I think you did that. Mom, mom got right? a new neighbor. Yeah? She's 23. The neighbor is 23? Yeah. And they bought the house? Yeah, it's like a, they're like a young couple. Wow. 23. They're rich, huh? They're like Emily. She's, got, she's a nurse. Oh, wow. Is Emily your sister? Yes. Uh, that's what I thought. My sister is the successful one. Mm, you're She's successful. I'm, yeah, but my sister has, like, bought a house and is a nurse. Uh, you go to school and be a nurse and be the same as Emily. Have, does she have a TV show? No, I mean, I'm successful in less conventional ways. Right. My sister is conventionally successful, and, um, what? I don't know. I'm trying to, like... I'm trying to, uh, like, at, find this thing on the, I'm, I'm doing the computer stuff. Uh, she is the, I call her the white sheep of the family. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. 
you know? <laughs> Looks pretty good. She stays in line. Well, more than uh, me and Andrew. Yeah. Nah. But maybe I'm the maybe <laughs> I don't know. Who's the we're gonna can we judge should we judge each other, Andrew? Uh, maybe I'm maybe you're the black sheep and I'm the gray sheep. Nah. No? You're gray. You're black. I'm black? Alright. What am I? Yellow. I'm black. Oh yeah. Um, Am I a member of your family? Probably yeah, not. sure. Alright, cool. I'm on the wrong side of the track, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, um, uh, uh me familia, you know, like, uh... Me familia, familia. Yeah. I'm just in a day. Yeah, right. I'm just gonna... Yeah, I have nine ended with that song, you're like, like, oh, familia, familia, familia. Yeah, you know, you know me familia, y'all follow you know what I'm talking about? No. What, The Sopranos? <laughs> No, it's in, in Fast to the Furious. So I, was, I was watching, I think it's like, it's either the third one or the fourth one. At the, at the end of the movie, they have a song, it's like, you want to know how we roll? This is how we roll. How do we roll? This is how we roll. <laughs> and that's the song. How do we roll? That sounds this pretty good. This is how we roll. I remember there was a song. Like, remember they did like the live action, like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie? Um, like the new one? Yeah, from like 2014 or something. I never did watch that. They had a song for that movie. Like, I think, I forget who was on it. It was like, um, some like cool rapper. And the, the, the song for the movie went like, Knock, knock, you about to get shell shocked. Knock, knock, you about to get shell shocked. Knock, knock, you about to get shell shocked. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> I, didn't watch the, I didn't watch the movie, but I listened to the song. <laughs> That's a good, a good song, song, I guess. Yeah. It was like, like they try to have a really big dramatic, like, the they get, like, like all these hip-hop artists to, like, make songs for, like, Space <laughs> Jam and, like, Spon the SpongeBob movies, and, you like, it feels like a weird placement where you have, like, hip-hop culture, like, crossing with, like, little kid stuff. But it's like what they do now. I don't know. I'm yeah. Like... Well, I mean, like, is that like Porky Pig? Like, did like a gangster rap? Yeah. I think <laughs> didn't. I, yeah. Yeah. I think that. I think that was good. <laughs> Hip hop is mainstream. <laughs> well, they, they, that movie just had like a constant like hip hop beat in the background the whole yeah. time, and I felt like Mark. It's like. <laughs> Mark is yeah, medium racist. He hates rap music. He always says, "Yeah, yeah." Mark might have something to say about that. Because right? I hate rap music. I'm like, why, Mark? Just, yeah. I just hate it. And I'm like, does that have anything to do with black people? <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> but I think it does. Knock, knock. You about to get shell shot? I think you should watch. Shell shot. We should all watch, should all watch that movie. Have you ever played uh, Ninja Turtles in time? No. I know Andrew has. Yeah, hey, you know, there's, a, there's like a Sega Ninja Turtles also. It was, it was probably just as good as that one, but we never played it. What's it called? I forgot. But it's like just as good as Turtles in time. Oh yeah, maybe I should play it, huh? Instead of starting yeah. a book club, we'll we find it on an emulator. Club. Yes. Can we start a movie club? Andrew has to be a part of it too, though. The what? Andrew, y'all fellow wants to start movie club, I guess. Okay. We have to watch the 2014 live action Teenage Mutant Nin uh, Ninja Turtles movie. What? I don't want to watch that. Why not? I guess uh, I could. Where is it? Michael Bay? Probably like you Michael it, Bay movie? You know? Yeah, isn't that Michael Bay? Yeah, I think it's got like, uh, what's that? But that uh, Megan Fox. Yeah, Megan Fox, yeah. I like the original... Did you kiss a turtle? I saw the original in the theater. Yeah. Oh, with, like, the people, like, in the costume what? and stuff, yeah. What? Really? You did? Yeah, you probably did, too. I, th I feel like that came out in the 80s. No, no, I think it came out, well, maybe 89, 91. Uh, I was born in 89. Oh, well, I think it came out right around then. Huh. I think it was right, 90. I think it was like 91. Well, how about for That's Movie good. Club we watch that, then? 
the first one of that. Series. Batman? No, no, that one, the first Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh, well, I've seen that one a lot of times. Oh, uh, then never mind. Have you What's seen that one? Movie? Yeah. That one, is Jim Henson made those costumes. Did he? That's yeah. Movie. It looks and really good, and the new ones, they look like monsters or something. Did you see that movie, um, this is like kind of like a artsy, like, like, fartsy pick. Did you ever see that movie? I don't know why it just popped into my mind. Did you ever watch, uh, and I never finished it, but I tried to start it, like, Holy Mountain? The Holy Mountain. No, I, I think I've taped over that before. <laughs> yeah, that's not surprising. That might be, I don't know. We tried to start, like, a book club, like, earlier this year, and it didn't amount to anything. I'm reading Of Mice and Men. That's right, yeah. Wow. Yeah, why don't you read that one? Is it a good Should book? I read it? Yeah, it's good, but it's kind of, it's surprising. I I didn't know what it was at all, but I'm, it's kind of short. Are you enjoying it? Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Are you gonna... um, maybe, when you read I'll the classics, to... though, it's like, like, this happened to me when I read, um, like, The Old Man in the Sea, also. Mm -hmm. But there's, like, lots of cultural references to this book. Mm. And you're yeah. reading the book and you're like, oh, hey, cultural references, you know? Mm. Yeah, Lenny killed the puppies. Hey! All right, well, we're going to watch the... Jeez, I didn't even get that yet, spoil! Oh, yeah, 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 don't spoil anything. He's a big dummy. Well, yeah, I know yeah, he's a big dummy, but you spoiled the movie or the book. Um, Wait, well, we're going to Andrew, watch The Holy Mountain. Show's over. Okay. The Holy Mountain. Did you read the book, okay. Andrew, or you have, to, you have to learn it in college, huh? All right, we're all watching no, The Holy a, Mountain. Ooh, that's a big cultural reference, too. Oh, well, I didn't get there yet. Oh, really not. We're on TCTV channel 22, 11, 30, 20, and pick it out here. But it should be on YouTube. 360, right there, 63, 44, message on TV. Show that. Where is it from? Yeah! 360, right there, 64, go down with your good time, thank you. TCTV, the baby, Jordan, Babbles, and Rooks, Christmas, Green, Buckner, Airport, Mountain Board, Northwest. Stop that call, this is kind of a thing. say thank you to the viewers, Junior, watching, thank you. Hey, John. Call me. Oh, yeah, dog. Bye.